Hi everybody, Scott Breen back in Las Vegas for round nine of the National Finals Rodeo. Who's ready to rock and roll on a Friday night? In the bareback, Corvallis Cowboy Caleb Bennett with his first round win this week. 88 points aboard Medicine Shell and nobody could catch him. He loved that draw. It was kind of in the back of my mind when I seen I had him. I thought that might be kind of a sleeper, you know, that not a whole lot of guys know to win the round on. And Heck, it paid off. I mean, that horse is awesome. Richmond champion was first out of the shoots tonight, the Stevensville Cowboy with 83 aboard Sesame Street, but that was bumped outside the money. Saddle Bronc is interesting tonight. Three local guys chasing cash. Chase Brooks comes out spurring Sun Glow. 89 points takes the lead. He would eventually place third. How about Wyoming's Brody Cress from Hillsdale aboard Kangaroo Lou? 91 points wins the round. He moves closer to that average win. He's also third in your world standings. Sage Newman, the Melstone NFR rookie, bucked off of Amazon Hills. But ultimately, Saddle Bronx, a battle between Utah brothers Ryder and Stetson Wright. Haven Medjit is smoking hot this back half of these finals. Your 2019 world champion from Miles City wins again tonight, 7.3 seconds. He's placed top two in each of the last four nights. And after opening the NFR 11th in the world, Medjit has suddenly climbed to fourth. We heard from him at 5.30. He said he has all his Christmas shopping knocked out. Steer wrestling goes to Will Loomis tonight. Team roping. Clay Tryon earns money for the fourth time in five go rounds. He and Jake Long split sixth in 4.4 seconds. Brenton Hall missed the head. He and Chase Tryon, no money. In the barrels, back to Wyoming for Gillette's Amanda Welsh. This is her first NFR. How about 13 and 54 for third place money tonight? Circles Lisa Lockhart with a tough finals. 13 84, no cash for the 15 time qualifier. In the bull riding, can anybody keep up with Parker Breading? Looks like maybe just one guy now. Breading bucked off for only the third time down here. So the average title tomorrow night comes down to a battle between Parker and Josh Frost. They're the only pair to ride six bulls this week. Shane Proctor, by the way, was bucked off again. He is so beat up, it's amazing he still climbs on. That'll do it from round nine. Next time I see you, will be championship Saturday, less than 24 hours from now, at the National Finals Rodeo in Las Vegas. Scott Breen, MTN Sports.